I'm Cameron McKenzie and I want to show you how to cancel a git merge that's in process. As you can see here I'm trying to merge this hotfix branch with the master branch. I'm currently on the master branch. I can do a git ref log and you can see that currently I'm at 475 FABB and the hotfix is down here at B17. Anyway, so I'm on the master branch and I want to merge that hotfix branch in and watch what happens as soon as I do it I get this merge conflict so I'm in the middle of a merge I'm merging then what do I do I want to get out of it well there's a couple of ways to get out of it my favorite git merge double dash abort couldn't be easier and if you take a look at the git ref log well you'll see that uh, it actually registers that we did a reset moving you back to head um, but you'll notice that the commit ID is the same as it was before I tried to do the merge and that just tells you that yeah you're basically in the same state that you were in before you tried to do the merge. So that's one way to do it. The other way to do it, well, let's trigger that merge conflict again, git merge that hotfix branch in, that problematic hotfix. And there's that alpha.html file again. We are in that merging state. Well instead of git merge double dash abort you can say git reset double dash hard do a hard reset and if you look at the git ref log you'll actually notice that the git abort which was this command here and the git reset which was this command here actually get the same message entry when the commit happens and you'll also notice that both of these operations reset you to the same commit ID that is the commit ID before you tried to do that merge conflict so those are two ways to cancel or I don't know, undo, uh, conflicted merge. Now I will say, if you you want to play the home game, uh, here's the git merge hotfix command. I'm going to try and merge these two branches together. I do have the conflict. You know, instead of undoing it, why not fix the conflict? So it tells me right here that the alpha file is problematic. I'm going to go in and edit that alpha file. It shows me what's currently in the tip of the, the head of the git branch so that's the code I've got that is the code that is in the hotfix branch that I need to merge together why not just bring it together merge that stuff combine it <laughs> fix it you know if this is source code you got to make sure it compiles and passes your unit test but save the changes do a git commit actually got to do a git add first git commit dash m I merged it and there you go, that actually merges it. If you do a git log dash dash one line dash dash graph dash dash all, you'll actually see that there's your master branch, there's the hotfix branch, and hotfix has now been merged in. So, bottom line, if you want to undo a conflicted merge, it's either git merge double dash abort or git reset double dash hard. <laughs> But, you know, also going in and fixing those merge conflicts isn't a bad idea either. So there you go. That's how you cancel a git merge conflict that's in progress. If you enjoyed that short tutorial, why don't you head over to the serverside.com. We've got lots of great tutorials over there about Git, GitHub, DevOps tools, and enterprise software development in general. If you're interested in my personal antics, you can follow me on Twitter at CameronMCNZ. And subscribe on the YouTube.